All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back with another box of Parkhurst Champions. I don't care if you like it or not, I f***ing love it. And we're gonna open it right here on the Just Hockey Cards channel. All right, boys and girls, check it out. The comments section have been, I would say, 50-50. Some of you guys really like Parkhurst Champions. The smart, cool kids all like Parkhurst Champions. Some of you poo-pooed it right away. Some of you even said that you threw all your cards away, which I don't believe that. But hey, to each their own, to each their own. I like it for various reasons. I like the history of Parkhurst. I like the kind of old school feel of the cards. I like the 50s. I like 50s music. I like old school hockey cards. I also feel like sometimes you just gotta step back and appreciate the product from a collector's point of view. This is a set I'm collecting. I'm not collecting 23, 24 game abuse. I'm not collecting 23, 24 uh, series two, not even collecting series one. Some folks are in it for the hits and I love hits too, but sometimes it's just refreshing to sit back and, uh, you know, kind of enjoy a product. I know a lot of people are poo poo in this thing and, uh, I don't know to me, you're wrong. One autographed or memorabilia hit per box. I think that's what a lot of people are poo pooing. Look, I get it. This stuff's not cheap. Nothing's cheap. A lot of people are like, oh, this this stuff, I mean, what is it? 118 bucks USD for this box of cards? They're like, oh, it should be $70. Yes, it should be $70. It should. And a fucking cheeseburger from McDonald's should be 99 cents. We gotta get over it. We gotta get over it, okay? It's expensive. It just is. Welcome to the new world. All right, right side, left side. So far, all of my really good ones have been coming out of the left. So we're gonna start off the right this time and see if it's really a thing. This is box number three, 300 some odd cards in the set. We've got some really cool inserts, some really cool parallels, short print rookies. We've got uh, short print legends. And of course we've got the itty bitties. We've got the 51, 52. Uh, Parkhurst throwbacks, and I really dig those. Maybe you should get three of those per box. Really would like to get a signed one. So we got some shininess right off the bat. Braden Tracy there, Frederick Carlstrom, and we've got Gino with the silver veteran. And then, okay, so this is one of the gold veterans. This is John Klingberg. Let's see, yeah, gold rainbow right there. And I think you get one of these, one of these per box and some base. Hey, real quick guys, something to watch out for is some of these, and I'll, I'll put a list up here. Some of these have short print image variants that you should be aware of and be looking for when you're going through these boxes. All right, pack number two, do me a favor guys, hit that like button if you like the video and uh, make sure that you hit that subscribe button while you're at it. We do lots of cool stuff on the channel and if you turn those notifications on, you'll get a little beep ding or whatever it is, an email or whatever it is. Every time we put something new up on the channel, there's Jeff Petrie with the veteran. And ah, we got one of our parkies. <gasps> oh, sweet, we got a rapper back. Who is it? Jonathan Chichu. <laughs> All right. This is pretty awesome. These are pretty hard to get your hands on. So the back of these cards obviously look like what the wrapper looked like back in the 50s. How cool is that? If I were a smart man, <laughs> if I were a smart man, <laughs> if the king had tits, he'd be the queen. So, <laughs> It's late at night, I'm loopy. Hey, if I were a smart man, I would have had a list off to the side that would be showing me the uh, image variations. So if I saw one, I'd be able to pull it aside and let you guys see. There's Jake DeBrusque there. 
Dylan Holloway rookie. And that, I believe, is one of the short print, okay? So anything over 300, I do believe, is a short print rookie. Next pack here. Lucas Raymond, <laughs> that kills me. Lucas Raymond is a veteran now. Mad Sogard, silver rookie. We got an Andre Case with the rainbow. Now, for some reason, some of these don't say rainbow on them, and I still haven't, I still haven't gotten a explanation on that. Base. All right, last pack from the first stack. Kirill the Thrill there. We got an Austin Matthews silver. That's pretty cool. Of course, Austin is on a tear this season. We got one of the wire photographs. Who is this one? Arturo Lincoln. Kind of dig these cards. Just looks like something that came off the Associated Press. I think that's why they call it a wire image. It reminds me back in the day, I worked uh, I worked in radio and used to pull stuff off the AP all the time for the news. If you guys like classic cards, you like old stuff like I do, you should check this video out right here. It's a new series that I'm doing. It's gonna be exclusively for members only, but I released the first one to the general public. It's Iconic Cards, the first one of the series is talking about the 1990-91 Yarmir Yager rookie card. And it's a really fun video, not very long, just a couple of minutes long, but it kind of details the card, talks about, you know, the, the history of the card and Yarmir, and I just think they're fun videos. We're gonna be doing a lot of those, probably uh, two of those a month inside the members area. There's Freddie Anderson, Dawson Mercer, and a Connor McMichael veteran silver parallel. Hey, we got another Parky here. And who we got? Matt Zuccarella. And see, that's what the normal back looks like. So I was kind of surprised. It was very tickled. I would like to have a whole set with the bubblegum wrapper back. I think that would be cool. So how's everybody doing with uh, SP Game Abuse? Man, I've been watching some breaks online. And uh, I mean, when they hit, they hit. But I would say 99% of the breaks that I've watched, uh, just just guys getting shit on. It's, it's terrible. And uh, it's not something that I'm going to be opening. Sorry. It's just uh, the profit and loss margin is just not there for me. Ryan Strom. Now, this is a color variant. And honestly, I think these look really cool. See, there is color variation. I just like the way uh, how uh, it's kind of distressed. I really think that's cool looking. Hmm, this pack feels a little chunky. Let's see. Nope. Just my imagination. Nazim Kadri back with the uh, Avalanche there. 22 23 product, you see. Josh Morrissey with a silver vet. And then we've got a Owen Power. And that is going to be one of our short print rookies. Very cool. How short print? I don't know. But apparently they are short print. Yeah, it's a base. All right, two more packs to go from the right-hand side. Got another rainbow variation here. That's your Dimco. There's J-Rob as a vet. That just kills me. And we got a Patty Kane veteran here. Now, see what I was saying? I don't know why some of these have rainbow on them and some of them don't. Maybe I can get an answer for you. Let me uh, let me reach out to um, let me reach out to my sources. 
Last pack down the right hand side, nothing too spectacular. We need to get that cool parkies there. Isaac Ratcliffe, we got Kyle Connor, who still has the most beautiful flow in the league. We got an Arbor Jockey, Silver Rookie, and oh, a Patrick Kane. Is this a gold one? I don't know. I can't tell if that's gold or not, but it's definitely badass. I mean, come on, these are, these are just cool. You know, kind of something that you would see in Skybox or something like that, but that, I mean, that's a really cool card. And base. All right, so here we go down the left-hand side, and that's usually where I've been getting my goodies, but I don't know if that's a, I don't know if that's a thing or just a couple of boxes that I did. But, uh, well, we definitely have a treasure here. Jordan Spence, Sebastian Ajo. We got Sean Crutier. And see, the last time I did this, I got a signature. So, or an autograph, rather. So, I can't tell. I can't tell. Can't tell. Who is it? Kent Johnson, man, I would like to have an auto of that. That would be cool. I like these two. This is another one that looks like something that would be in Skybox Metal Universe. All right, next one down the left. We got Nylander there. Jonathan Taves, or Johnny Toes. We got another Parkies here. Who is it? Mad Sogard. Nope, just a Reggie. And base. All right, let's see what we got here next pack. Got Kucherov with silver. That looks really good with the blue uniform, I think. And then we got it, whoa! So it's uncommon to get two of these in the same box, I do believe. So Tristan Jari there. As of me recording this, the Penguins just squeaking into the playoff picture now. We'll see. Uh, I don't know if they can still get knocked off or not, but we'll have to watch the next couple of weeks. Trey Fix, Wolanski, the guy's everywhere. Alexander Barkov, and we did get, oh, this is going to be a high... I do believe we should call that a short print rookie. Very cool. Getting down to the nut cutting here, and we haven't gotten... Now, is that... Yeah, I think that's just another... I think that's just another rainbow. Kevin Hayes there, and we got Anthony Duclair. With a rainbow variation. There it is, right there. I don't understand. Base. All right, last stack here, guys. Looks like we got another treasure chest. Do we have also? Nope, just a treasure chest. So if it's an auto, let's hope it's a banger of an auto. Oh. I can't, oh guys, you don't know how much this troubles me. We have a problem. We have a problem. Ladies and gentlemen, we have problems. I can't throw it. I can't throw it because I need it for the set. All right, well, let's hope we get something good here to offset that. Or shit. Gonna be a predator. Can't see the number there. Yep, Tanner Janot. Janot? Janot. Well, this is a gold one too. So the prints on these are, well, obviously shorter than the regular ones. So we got a gold. That's about two boxes in a row. I pulled a gold one.
So that definitely made up for the Tom Wilson. Um. Hmm. That could be our auto right there, and it's on a blue. And I'll tell you the auto I'm looking for <laughs> is Wayno. So let's... We got three packs to go. Let's set this one aside, and we'll open up this next one here. I finally learned how to say this kid's name. Vladislav Kalyachinok. Huh? 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 It was probably still wrong. <laughs> There's Zuccarella there. Hey, now that is a banger of a card. Dominic Hashik. Legend, short print legend. Outstanding. That's a cool card. All right, two packs to go, and then we got what appears to be an autograph, a short print auto. There's Trevor Zegris, Mitch Marner. We got Debrinkit here with a silver, and we got a Mad Sogard. This has been a Mad Sogard centric box. It's all right, I guess. And base. All right, last one to go. Hey guys, wouldn't you love to join us inside the Collector's Club? That's our membership area. That's uh, about to be loaded up with a lot of member-only content and some live chats and stuff like that. Would really love to see you guys in there, help support the channel. We got Morgan Riley there with a veteran and we got another, what we got here? Here's a Mo Cider with a wire. What are we talking about here? Cider's goals, exit. yep. There we go. Wire image. So I know when I see that blue there, that that's, that's probably an auto. It's at least a numbered card. And I know that there are 300 <laughs> some odd cards in the set and they can all be blue. But to me, when I see that blue one like that, it just, I just go, oh, that's gonna be a Wayne Gretzky auto, but I'm sure it's not. But let's see who we've got here. Blue veteran. I can't, why can I never see the damn numbers? So this is out of 15. Braden Shen, oh man. But hey, it is eight out of 15. Braden Shin, on card auto. We will take it. Didn't get my Gretzky. B -b -b Bullshit! All right, the hits, the hits, the hits. We got a few, let's talk about them. This was not the best box that I've opened, but it's still a lot of fun. Hope you guys had a lot of fun watching with me. We did get this legend, Dominic Hasek. Pretty sweet Patty Kane jukebox hero. Found some buried treasure with Kent Johnson and Tanner Janot. A couple of color variations, Trista Jari and Ryan Strom. Got some itty bitties here, Mad Sogard and Matt Zuccarello. And then we got this cute little Jonathan Chichu with the Parkies wrapper back. So cool. And then our auto, eight out of 15. We got Braden Shen here on card auto with the blue. All right, so that's it. Hey, look, not a banger of a box, but look, I had a really good time opening it. And I hope you guys enjoy me because I'm gonna be opening a lot, lot more of this stuff. To me, it's a really fun set. There's some new cool looking stuff like the Tomorrow's Riches. And there's some really, really cool old school 51, 52 parkies with the wrapper back. I mean, come on, that's kind of cool. I don't know, maybe I'm weird. The only set that I've had probably more fun opening as of late has been 2223 Skybox Metal Universe. And 
I made that set my bitch. You guys go back and look at the past videos of me opening that. I have I crushed it with that set. And that's what made it fun. <laughs> All right, hey, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and turn those notifications on so you get updates on cool stuff that we're doing on the channel. Consider joining us inside the Collector's Club, trying to build a community here, a community of like-minded folks. Um, it's in its infancy right now, as every all things have to start somewhere. But I really want to grow a community of guys that like to get together, open some hockey cards together, talk about hockey cards on the, on the Discord channel. We've got our Friday night brews and breaks where we basically sit around, have a couple of have a couple of tall boys and open cards here with a live stream. So it's a lot of fun. Consider joining us. I think our next live stream is going to be not this coming Friday, but the Friday after next. I think is when I'm going to plan that. So hopefully you guys can join us in here and uh, you know join in on the fun. So until next time, we'll see you guys. Don't forget to turn those notifications on for cool stuff like this.